Hi dancers, today I just wanted to give you a quick and sloppy description of the two general types of dance. I call them spot dances and progressive dances. Um, more or less, you can see that spot dances usually don't travel much. They tend to be done in a very small area. Progressive dances do travel, always counterclockwise around the floor. Um, spot dances are usually danced on the balls of the feet, where progressive dances will roll through the whole foot. Um, spot dances usually have hip, hip action, progressive dances usually not. Spot dances usually uh, do not have rise and fall, progressive dances usually do. Spot dances usually don't have sway, progressive dances usually do. Spot dances are associated with Latin and rhythm categories in ballroom competitions. Progressive dances are associated with standard and smooth dances or, or categories. Um, you can see this real easily in performance and um, competition videos because usually the spot dances the girls will be wearing short skirts like super skimpy usually and then normally in, in the progressive category they'll be wearing the very long more ballroom style skirts. Um, as far as shoes usually the spot dances the ladies will be wearing open toed shoes or sandals and normally closed toed shoes in progressive dances. Um, as far as music Quite often you'll find that those progressive dances are associated with Spanish in the music um, and the progressive dance, or sorry, the spot dances, I said progressive, this, the spot dances will normally have Spanish um, and the progressive dances of course can be in any language. Here in the US they're more commonly uh, in English. So um, these are just general, these are descriptive rather than prescriptive, so there are lots of exceptions and I'm sure you can think of some, but um, it can be helpful when you're learning a, a dance to begin with um, to figure out which category it goes in. It can give you a lot of information about that dance right off the bat.